make it make sense? Could somebody please make it make sense? Big Mills! Surfer. Make it make sense, tell me how you squeeze it. Make it make sense, tell me about the things that you say. Make it make sense, tell me about the things in your dreams. Let me drug out all the things in between. Make it make sense, tell me how you squeeze it. Make it make sense, tell me about the things that you say. Make it make sense, tell me about the things in your dreams. Let me drug out all the things in between. Make it make sense. Okay, sorry. It still gets me. I watch it, that intro with you guys. Y'all, Potomac is heating up. And we thought that this current week's episode that just aired last night was hot. But next week's episode is going to be on fire. There's so many fights that happen. Giselle, oh, sorry. Spoiler alert. Spoiler alert. If you do not want to know anything about what's going to go on next week, this is not the particular video for you. Spoiler alert. If you do, then okay, here we go. <laughs> okay, there's going to be fights between Giselle and Candace, Candace and Ashley. But what I picked out is Ashley finally. Candace gave it to her, guys. And Candace gave it to her by naming a name. Now, of course, it's going to be bleeped out, but I'm going to share this clip with you. Hopefully, I don't get in any kind of trouble, but I'm going to share this clip with you guys because it, it's a lot, and it's a lot with very little said. It's, it's explosive, She named, but the fact that a name has been put to it, we'll get to it. Let me show you the clip. Let me show you the clip. Oh, that's no, this is not good. <laughs> Shout out to the Bravo Shade Room. This is their clip. Follow him on Instagram. Shout out to Gabor, Andrew Gabor on YouTube. Follow him. He's going to be reviewing the show. Also, Busy Blue, he reviews Potomac as well on YouTube. Follow them. And I'm going to be with Philly Diva tonight discussing this. Heard that Chris has been in some other DMs that are not quite as innocuous and innocent. Chris has been in other DMs. I don't believe it, but Ashley's putting it out there, guys. And because I'm actually showing you a clip of the show, I have to break it up. I can't just show you the complete. It's a short clip, but I can't just show it all the way through. Ashley, your just husband so you know, likes to leave you, do you, do you wanna, and do go you, to a man. It's coming. Man named oh. house. And suck this dick. Oh. Candace, you had this information the whole time. Like, Candace is dropping so much tea. It's spilled on the floor, you guys. I'm not joking. <laughs> Are you veering off the so, path? So let's. Ashley's stone cold face wants nothing to do with this information, but she's going to deflect. Nah, is this deflection? Because Chris ain't sucking no dick. Okay, I'm sick to my stomach. We suck it. Me too, Karen. I'm sick to my stomach too. We can't do that. No. When you know Little Red Riding Hood has that face on, she's about to be messy, and I'm here for it. I was not supposed to talk about this 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 person. But you are. You are about to talk about this person. Um, but he says Michael Darby is a client of his. So it is a a person who is in that particular type of industry. I need a name. I need an interview. Candace, I need an interview. Drop it in my DMs, Candace. Make it make sense now on Instagram. I want to interview this worker. Allegedly. Yes. That's what your ass get, because I was holding on to that. You. Y'all. Candace just laid it on the ground. Now, this is all alleged, but I thought you guys had to know because this was hot off the presses. I'll be back tonight talking about this with Philly Diva. Yes, the Philly Diva, who Diana from Beverly Hills called a dark content creator. We will be on live talking Potomac, talking Robin's behavior, talking Giselle, talking Candace. It'll be a quick one, but we will be here tonight 
Guys, I will see you for the next one. This was a lot. This was way more. This this was way more than I expected this morning. See y'all later. <laughs>